Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. George Washington Koontz was born on this day 200 years ago, oh, April 6th, in Washington, Pennsylvania. In 1836, he came to Natchez and joined the William Britton Bank. Later, both Koontz and Audley Britton became partners. In 1860, it became Britton and Koontz Bank and operated under that name until 2013. In 1845, Koontz married Roan Beltsuber and four years later bought the house now known as Greenleaves. They raised their eight children there. During the Civil War, Koontz, who knew Jefferson Davis was a Confederate spy, he reported on the Union gunboats passing through Natchez. He was also sent to Europe to get loans for the a Confederacy. He took his children and other Natchez children to school there. After the war, Koontz signed the Amnesty Oath and was given a pardon signed by President Andrew Johnson. The carpetbacker on the horseback who shot at Koontz on his front porch must not have known Koontz was pardoned. George Washington Koontz died on April 4, 1876. His descendants still live at Greenleaves today. My name is J.T. Coy and I, George Washington Coots, is my great, 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 great grandfather. This has been your Natchez History Minute.